Marty, the all important track report ahead of tomorrow night's racing. Firstly, how much rain did we receive with last night's storm and what impact has that had on the track? Uh, ben, we had uh, just under 18 mil, 17.4 mil in that half hour period. Um, come down really quick and very heavy. And with that, it's um, given the track a really good soaking and um, you know, it probably helped us out a bit to say just have to watering probably uh, tonight. So with that, yeah, like I said, about 18 mil for the week so far. It is warm weather and drying conditions today, but there is a possibility of more rain tonight. What surface do you think will be starting on tomorrow? Well, we're currently on a soft five um, after that rain. Uh, with the weather forecast for today is about 31 degrees and reasonably strong winds. And so with that, the track will naturally improve and get back into that good four range. But the forecast is for like 0 to 20 mils again tonight. So if we get the lower side, naturally we'll be on a good four. If we get the higher side of that forecast and we do get that rain, then we'll be back in that soft five range. And lastly, the rail stays in the six metre position from last week's meeting. Talk us through the reasoning behind that. Oh, well, we raced on a good three last week. We got an early upgrade and there was very little damage done. And with that, when we were last in the true, it was, it was our third meeting in the true in a row and we raced on a soft track and there was just a bit of wear and tear there. So we just thought giving it that extra week to recover will help us out for, with the uh, races we've got coming up in the next two or three weeks. So we'll be out six again for this week, get through uh, tomorrow night and then we'll go back to the true for the following week.